Welcome. In this video, I'll show you how to enable HVCI in Valorant, all right, for you to be able to fix the HVCI enabled error. So first up, open up your search bar and just type in device security. Okay. Once this one pops up, just go and click on it. Wait for it to open. Now, once it's opened, go ahead over to core isolation details. Click on it and make sure that memory integrity is toggled on. And once that's toggled on, just go to restart your computer. And after that, you're good to go. Now, what if you don't see the memory integrity option in here? Well, the problem is on your BIOS, the hardware virtualization is not enabled. Okay, so how do we fix that? First up, go ahead and uh, open up your favorite browser. Okay, now type down your motherboard's model. Okay, for example, I do have a uh, B550 Pro 4 motherboard. Then just go ahead and uh, type in enable virtualization. Just click on it. As you can see here, you will have a ton of options, especially on AI right here, which is pretty smart. You'll first need to enter your BIOS. Okay. And then once you have the uh, BIOS opened, you can now go, go to advanced CPU configuration tab and make sure that SVM mode is set to enabled. This one is correct. Okay. Now, if you don't know what your motherboard model is, you can go ahead over to your search bar and type in system information. Okay. Click on it. Now go ahead and find your baseboard manufacturer and a baseboard product. Okay. Here I have my B550M Pro 4 and which is from ASRock. That is it. Once you have the SVM or virtualization mode enabled, you can now go ahead and go back to uh, device security. Okay. And then core isolation should be available now. Well, I hope this video helps and I'll see you in the next one.